the streak is over. Changes in life happen. I've had a great time with Audi, starting Formula E from, from the very beginning. It's been amazing, but also I'm really looking forward to a new challenge now. I feel like it's a, it's a fresh start for me and um, I'm excited about it. Yeah, of course, switching uh, teams mid-season is normally not something uh, that you do or that you plan to do. Uh, so it's a big task because there's not too much time to prepare for the last six races in Berlin now. And of course, there's a lot for me to learn just because the cars basically look the same from the outside. There's a lot of difference uh, when it comes to the steering wheel, the software, uh, also the way of working with the team, new people, the structure, uh, the simulator. There's so many things that are then basically brand new for me now. So um, it's a big challenge, but I think we, we know that. We knew that from the very beginning and uh, we will take the time as best as we can to prepare um, and to be ready for Berlin. Yeah, I think everyone in the paddock knows that Oliver is a, is a great racing driver and uh, so do I. We've, we've raced a lot together. Uh, when I had my pole position in Berlin, he was standing next to me. When I did my first win in uh, Mexico, uh, he finished second and uh, yeah, we fought a lot on track and uh, of course he has a lot of experience in this car, in that team and uh, he will be a hard teammate, but I think our main target now is to, to get into the points as a team. That I think has to be the main goal and not having a fight between us. So we will work together, we will push hard and make the best out of it. Yeah, of course Berlin has been an amazing ground for me as a racing driver. I took uh, a very special win there. This is the trophy by the way. And also the other races I've, I finished uh, well in the points, uh, did another podium. So of course I always feel super excited going there because of it being my home race and there's just uh, so much energy around it, but of course this year it's a bit different. First of all, I will not have the fans that uh, support me at the track. Uh, and second of all, of course, it's a, it's a new team and a new car for me. So um, just because the past has been good doesn't mean that uh, now everything is for granted for that six races. But of course, I'm highly motivated and I will give my very best to then give the fans at home um, the best possible show. I think it's quite cool that we change the layouts. I think it will create a new challenge. We cannot prepare that much. So I think it will really mix things up and make it very, very difficult for, for everyone. It's the same for everyone. Uh, so the goal has to be to, to adapt as quick as possible to the new layout. Also when it comes to energy management, I think that's the, the, the most tricky part to get everything right because normally you spend a lot of time in advance in the simulator um, practicing all that, but now that's gone. And I, I think that feels a bit more like the classic type of racing from back in the days when you didn't have all the sims and stuff. So uh, I think it's gonna be good and uh, it will mix things up and create a, a good racing. And I love being in Formula E. I've always uh, pushed very hard for, for people to follow it and to promote it. And um, I just love being part of the whole Formula E family. So I'm excited to go back. Yeah, can't wait to see everyone and uh, full attack.